welcome back to our channel. Uh, I'm Corinne. I'm Colleen. And we're the Grace Knit Stitchers. Tonight we are coming to you right before midnight for the 24 Hours of Cross Stitch. And 24 Hours of Cross Stitch this time, oh my, Doggy Hit Buttons oh. is going to start on the 23rd at midnight. So this is a very special edition and we're kind of going to do something different. We did one before, but we're going to actually post a few of these um, instead of making them all into one long. I don't know which way is more fun to watch. You guys will have to be the ones to tell us. Um, so leading up to tonight, we got a few projects done. I was working my tush off trying to get caught up. We have a stowaway, by the way. This is Paris. Um, we, I wanted to get this done. I didn't want to count that as 24 hours across it. That didn't happen. So I guess I'll start first. Hmm. Where's my board? Hmm. <laughs> Look at us totally not prepared. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> it's under. Sorry. I was like, I'm leaving that out so we have it. Okay. So I got a lot done from earlier. Sorry, babe. I'm blocking you. But I just had this ball to finish here. I did finish that one. Uh, it's Christmas ball. And I don't even know what this is here. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to do. And then there's some wreath going around it. Uh, I'm sure there's a little bit of back stitching. There's a few stitches I missed in here. I'll catch up on those and I have 530 or something like that to go. 530 stitches. We will be back with you probably around 3 a.m. I'm not going to post that. Uh, I'm just going to post this intro video. Um, I told you guys, you probably see me on pajamas. I'm in my comfy clothes right now. I'm it's in PJs. pajamas. But I'll be in my PJs at our 3 a.m. set. We'll probably be in a few. Um, but we're going to go to bed. Around three. Around three. And then we'll get up again. Um, we might get up earlier than we thought because we're thinking about going getting Marianne's famous oh, donuts. donuts. She oh, has the best donuts ever. And if I can remember, I will take pictures Ooh. because they get the maple ones are amazing. Um, I will say the bacon, it feels a little undercooked. It's very chewy, but I mean, it's... Yeah, last time we got maple bacon. Not for 24 hours of cross stitch. Oh, right. But um, they also sell maple. Um, so the ones who didn't care for the bacon, I'm doing maple. Oh. I'm not doing bacon. We can just do maple because... Dad wants the bacon. Oh. So Alan didn't like the bacon. He, I don't think he would. So maybe two people will get bacon. I'm not sure. Two out of six. Um, and then we get to get a second flavor if I'm buying a dozen. So I'm going to go up before midnight and pick our kinds because I don't want to waste my time. We were doing some prep. Um, right. My daughter, I'm gonna. Ha my youngest. I asked her if she wanted to hop on, and she wants to take a quick nap. Um, she's going to do some bobbinating for me. Did she guarantee that? She did. Okay. She just said uh, she. <laughs> so she is the one who does plastic canvas because it's mind numbing work, and she doesn't have to think about it. And she doesn't want to do designed plastic canvas because. Then she'd have to find follow a pattern and everything that goes with that. So instead, um, yeah, she just does solid colors. And so I said, I have some mindless work for you at midnight. And she's like doubting me. So I held up my CXC that I only bobbinate during my virtual lessons. And I'm down some virtual lessons, which is good. They're coming in person. So I'm not getting them bobbinated really fast. And I'm afraid Cinderella is going to be called soon. And that's what those are for. So I held up the baggie of the bobbins and the floss. And I shook them in front of her. And she just looked at me and went, it's not midnight yet. Mm. Okay. So I think she's going to do it. Whereas my other middle daughter will do a diamond art. And she will not come on to show you. Oh, but we can just tell you. She's working on Starry Night. Yeah. Van Gogh. Van Gogh. All right, show yours. Okay, um, I'll just show you. I'll show you what it looks like. Miss Mabel's cap, my whip girl, and now we did more planning. And I'm my, and I'm actually my planner, which right after we filmed today, we went over to Hobby Lobby. That's what. Okay, so yeah, I'll tell you that. That's what I was trying to think of what we were doing. Um, oh, I don't want to spoil what she's going to tell you. It's right there. You can show. But um, we started getting the 24 hours of cross stitch marathon pages ready for our planners because I didn't want to take our 24 hours to make them. So that's, that was the other part I wanted to tell okay. so you can show. So everyone is probably aware that she had, with her happy planner, she has a hole punch because she has put so many pages into her planner. But look what I got. 
So my planner is Agenda 52, and then I just put like a label. by the paper studio. Paper studio. Um, and then I put a label with my name on it. Yeah, because but this you know, was dad was late. Pre-made. Label this happy. was from his work. Then. Yeah. So I just um, like lunch. Yes. Yeah, so Agenda 52. I don't know if that's just Hobby Lobby's brand. Mm -hmm. It's from the paper studio, and um, they are all 50 percent off this week. And I think they go on sale every two to three weeks. There's like a white and denim striped one. Oh, I like that. Uh, it's a binder. It's a planner. Yeah. Binder oh, yeah, planner. it's just the binder. Yes. Mm -hmm. And our binders are up in July, June. I think mine goes to July. Yeah, because we, we do it by the school year. We start in August, so that's when our planner's in. Mm -hmm. All right. Miss Mabel's mm -hmm. cat. Um, and I'm going to show you my progress on it. And I, depending who, well, maybe five people watch it, but I kind of want a vote on it. Should I do more of the cat or go into the hat? Ooh. The cat or the hat? Like, because I have that's the hat. There's well, the, the hat cat. has a lot of confetti. I think I would go with the cat. So you can feel like you're getting a good amount of progress to begin with. And then when you get to the hat, it'll fill out and look beautiful. Oh, that would be. So I'll have a cat and then I'll add the hat. Oh. I won't have a hat and add the cat. Okay, you, you can just show it. Okay, my cat sneeze. Okay, so it's this way. I did it wrong earlier. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> So this is where we are starting, or she is starting. Mm-hmm. Oh, do we, can I talk about my plans first? Yes. Um, plans have changed. So I looked at my web Google. It's 15 hours. Not I, 24. I will look. Um, so I will not work for this the whole 24 because that. I'm going to, as soon as I start stitching, I will hate this linen. Um, so I only work maybe like 10 hours on it. And you guys just saw what Mermaid and Dolphin is. So I'm going to try and finish that. And then we're gonna push through and work on Goose Girl. I gotta get done. So it's kind of funny. We we're getting ready to come down here and film. We we have our own craft room in our finished basement, and um, we left our stuff sitting up. And before we came down to film, I said to Colleen, "I'm like, uh, how many hours do you have on your cat?" And she's like, "Why?" I said, "Because I have an idea." I said, well, tell me your hours. And she said, 15 hours. So I told her. I was going to surprise her on camera. Oh, and then we figure out. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I was like, you know, you really want that mermaid and dolphin finish. So just put in some hours. So you're going to start with 10 hours, right? With yeah. Mabel's cat. She'll go to the mermaid and dolphin. Didn't I just say all And this? then go back to the cat. Well, you didn't say about going back say... to the cat. Okay. Maybe go because back to the goose cat. Girl... Or a goose girl. Goose girl's annoying you. And she doesn't hate all linen. If you didn't watch our video earlier, and you're just a 24 hours across stitch, it's a stiff linen that stretches. And when you put a needle through it that's too big, it leaves a hole and it stays until you reshape it. It is strange linen. I don't remember where it came from. It's old. This is like at least 20 years old. So Oh man, the fabric older than me. Yeah, so don't... You know, I don't even know if they make linen like this anymore. I, I did see it at the crusted shop that's closing, but I bet you she's had it for 20 years. So, yeah, we don't hate on all linen. No, we don't because Miss Cherry Blossom is a linen and it is, I would say stiff because the Q-snap, once I have it, like it still has the Q-snap. Like it is a stiff, but yeah, I like working on it. And then if before 3 a.m., because I only have 500 stitches and these are kind of big blocks, I'll go to work on this. I am going to start the alphabet since it's exposed, um, take my necessary photos, and then I will go up and work on this big, huge motif and try to get it done. Um, I'm going to insert a picture of our food. What's that? Good. That's why my girls are so, so excited. Um, they already have the table all set out with their snacks. They hate washing the table for some reason. I washed it after two dishes. Oh, okay. But I looked at my youngest. I'm like, did you guys wash the table before you put all the snacks on it? She's like, yes, of course we did. Mm -hmm. um, so there you go. We'll insert that photo. Um, but on our last day, we just, the one we just uploaded today, um, <coughs> we mentioned I was on Facebook and I've been on Facebook for a while. Um, but I just updated my photo. And that's a sneak peek to my senior pictures. Yeah, when, when we decide what all her senior pictures are gonna be. My sis, my mother has a professional camera and she doesn't have confidence in her oh, photos. Really? She likes outdoor photos, but not her indoor photos. Um, but she does beautiful pictures of roses. I mean, she's 
won things with her photos, but they're landscapes and stuff like that. Um, won contests, but my sister takes, my sister is good at posing. Um, she's got two kids and she goes on Pinterest and for like when they were little, she would put them in a bowl, you know, put the roses <laughs> and it wasn't a failed thing. I mean, it was gorgeous. Like, oh my goodness. Tangent or not tangent, bunny trail. My niece, when she was little, was reading a book in a little tiny rocking chair with glasses on. And that still is one of my favorite, most favorite pictures. And it was totally posed. My niece also likes to pose. Mm -hmm. um, so anyway, long story short, my mom likes how my sister poses people and just tends to get the shots that she wants. So she took Colleen out in mm -hmm. what, six, seven different outfits, different locations. Different locations, yeah. And, and but she took ten to twelve of each thing. So I have to figure out what we I don't want. I did a few more because there's ones where I was blinking. Um, I mean, this is about twenty four cross stitch, but I, um, the one I'm sitting in our steps and the lighting looked better with our lights off. So when she was turning on the flash, she was like, "Are you smiling?" And so those pictures look creepy because I'm just all in like a fancy dress and I'm just like staring with a creepy look. <laughs> <laughs> so. <clears throat> I'm a Mary Kay consultant. I don't advertise that because I don't really sell to people. <laughs> I sell to myself. Um, so I call it a personal use, Mary Kay consultant. But any of my girls who want to are going to tonight, you're not going to catch us on video. <laughs> I don't know if Colleen's going to snap a picture since she has her own phone now. But I will be doing a charcoal mask and encouraging my daughters to do it along with me. Because we haven't done it in It's months. good for you and it burns. It burns. It's not supposed to burn. But Stinks. I am bad and... Four nights this past week, I have not taken my rosacea medicine. Mm. So when you see us at 3 a.m., my face is looking really bad. Oh. But this will clear everything out so that I can start taking care of my skin again. So this is a restart. A reset to my skin. And off we go. So mm, 15 minutes and counting. We'll see if we can get this uploaded. So you guys can start with us, hopefully. Friend us on Facebook. Uh -huh. Send us. I don't know how you can find us and, like, tag us on Instagram. But we will be updating Instagram. I promise. I'm going to try. <laughs> <laughs> Happy stitching. Bye.